Come on, level 5 drop. There it is. We got the safe. It's done. Hey, what's going on, everybody? It is Starkler coming back at you with another video, and today I am going to be fighting the Witch Hunter, and no, it is not an internet troll online. We're talking about an actual cog that is a part of the Kudos board for Ye Old Toontown, and it actually took me a while to find out where exactly I had to go in order to load into this boss fight, but apparently this right here is the spot, hence the ladder, and, uh whatever these things are that I have to stand on <laughs> in order to go fight the boss. Uh, and it actually took me a while to figure out how to get up here. It took me forever until I finally realized that there's a ramp in front of the trolley. And I had no idea that that's how you get up here. But yeah, for those who don't know, at least now you know how to get up here. And we've sort of made it to the part now in this little boss run series where it's going to start taking me much longer in order to finish the kudos board in order to fight these bosses because it's going to get harder i thought this was the one i had to do again i have to find a group because i have i literally have like no one to to fight the boss with so i have to go make a group so i'll be back in a second after i make that group and then we will go and fight this boss okay so i couldn't find any groups so i had to uh I had to make one myself, so hopefully we get some people after a couple of minutes. Hopefully this doesn't take too long. Oh great, right as I start recording that dude leaves. I've been waiting here for like 20 minutes, and I finally found one tune that wants to do this. But that means we're only halfway there because we need two more. Because I'm not going to do this with less than four people because I have no idea what I'm getting myself into. Okay, it looks like we have a full group. We are here. Good luck, everybody. Here we go. We got the full group. Oh, I was hoping we'd climb the ladder. That's okay. A uh, friendly reminder, I have no idea what I'm getting myself into, so... Uh, this is all new to me. Power level. Oh, okay. So this is the Witch Hunter. I had a fraction of the power that those, what are they, gorgers, possess. Let's do it. Yeah. We've been sodding you out, too. I like the Lawbot logo on his hat. Let's do this. I have lure, so... What are you doing, burning down the pole? The flagpole? I like the cutscenes. Unfortunately, I, s I don't have tune up on this tune. But here we go, level 20. And we have level 6 gags now, which is nice. So I'm just gonna go with the flow, I'm just gonna be honest and say this is my first time here. <laughs> I have to let him know. What do you mean, so? What, I mean, does that not, like, take a hint to you that obviously I don't know what I'm doing? Come on, now. More cogs equals more power for him. Okay. Did we even make a dent in that cog? Okay, we did, yeah. Oh yeah, I also I got my safe like right before I got this boss fight. I could squirt it. There you go. Actually, I'll use a bigger one. Bigger one. We've got big gags for a reason. Oh, that packs a punch. Why does this dude have a rain cloud on top of him? Other cogs gain extra attack and more mob grows. Aw, oh, too bad they're not there with you. Oh, well they are now. I spoke too soon. 
Except there's four of them. Are we gonna have five cogs in this fight? We are gonna have five. There's the cat. I can get rid of this one. Oh, I could trap the cat. Hey, kitty. That does 250 damage. If someone could just help out with that, there you go. Say goodbye, cat. Insert club name here. That's a good club name, right? Bewitched. Why are my feet going through the floor? We're just taking them out one by one. I want to see a zap-squirt combo. That would be fun. We got the squirt, which means that now they're wet. So what if we... What if we... Squirt the number cruncher and then zap... The witch hunter. That could damage a bunch of cogs. Let me see if they'll be down for that. Food. I don't have any food. Sound. Okay. 30, 60, 90. Honestly... Yeah, okay, that's fine. I think we still need a trunk, though, don't we? Because the level 8 is 127. We need a trunk. There you go. There you go. No. Trunk. Winch. Witch Hunter. I like these custom looking cogs. 4 times 30. That's 120. It's not 127 though. Or whatever the amount of that cog is. It's a witch cog. I want to see some cog magic. Now we have five cogs. Yeah, the kitty's back. So now what do we do? What does that do? No, okay. I'll just do this. That does enough. Yeah, we have to attack that witch hunter. Yeah, that makes sense. Whittling it down the cog. I guess we are seeing some magic happen. Everybody's getting burned. Taking flame damage, that's not good. Should we use sound or squirt zap combo like I suggested? We're working on it. Oh, I just realized now he actually has hair. You see that? He's got a little bun in the back. What's that, throw book? It looks painful throwing a book at someone. I'm the only one here with full laugh. Too bad I don't have tune up. We just have to slowly work our way down. I don't have much for you knights. Well, actually, I have some, but not a lot. Okay, let's do it. Throw! Throw at him. Are you going for me, finally? The witch hunters bewitches the tunes. What happened? You gave me a witch hat. I like the witch hat. I wish I could keep that accessory. Get blasted, old man. Oh, it missed on me, okay. Get Mark. Who's Mark? Here, I'll use- I'll be the one to use the elephant trunk. I'm gonna use the elephant. I got prestige sound. Watch these moves. Watch what I could do. We're doing good, though. He's at, like, around halfway down now, so... And we're eliminating all the other cogs. My question is... Is there going to be a second phase or anything, or is it going to be mostly the same throughout the entire boss fight? Because I feel like there's probably going to be some sort of second phase or something. Yeah. 
Yeah, I get it now. Being able to take out those other cogs earlier on is definitely the best choice, because I don't want to see what it looks like when other cogs get boosted like that. I'd rather see him look like an idiot just doing it by himself, his little arm movements. Like, yeah, it's me! Look at me, leveling up! Five. Yeah, five cogs. So what's the game plan? More throw? Or I could use, like, a big massive trap or something on him. Um... Trap the cat? Yeah. Man, they must really not like the cat, but I think it's because it's a level 11 EXE. So I can understand why they're doing that. You going for me again? Whoa. So what does that do? That gave me a witch hat, but did that actually do anything to me? Yeah, I mean, I like the accessory. The pain and misery. It's like psychological pain that the cogs are inflicting. Except for me, it's joy because I actually like the hat that he's giving me. When the cat slides in, it must be yeeted. Fair enough. <laughs> oh, now we're all on fire. Are well done. Cook to perfection. Mmm, we got like roasted cat, mice, and rabbits. Mmm, uh, I'm assuming that's gonna be enough. Jeez, we've got a lot of cogs on our hands. I think now would be a good time to tell them that I'm Tuna Bliss. Just so they know. I don't want to get sacked. You knights. Wait, what did they say? Wait, I need to hear that. Where's the filter? That looks like they want to use tune up. Okay. Okay, we'll just. That's the best trap I got, so if you have the courage, the courtesy to take out that cog, then I appreciate it. I ran out of all my good trap. Oh crap, is that going for me? Wait, is nobody using tune-up? Oh, you are. Okay, thank you. Appreciate it. By the way, is if, if anybody knows how to get rid of this text box, like I hit T and then I type my message and I'm good, but then I always have to manually click the X in the corner. If you guys know of a button that can just make it go away, then please tell me, because I just, I hit the exit key and it doesn't do anything. Yeah, it doesn't do anything. There we go. Under Article 14, Section C. What does that mean, Section C? We gonna sound again? I'm growing accustomed to this battle style. 132. Yeah, I know the drill. Hey, we have a good system established. I just hope that this works out to the end. Doot doot. Beep beep. We're just very slowly chipping him down. He only has a little over a thousand left. And that is not good. Oh, stop it. Ooh, that was close. Thank you. Still don't want to see what the mob mentality thing looks like. We've done a good job at fighting off all the other cogs. Gosh, look at all those cogs. Got the Mr. Hollywood. The cat's back. I know the drill. We must eliminate the cat. Kill the cat. Wow, we've got all different cog types here, I think. I think... Is that a board bot? Oh no, that's a law bot, cash bot, board bot, cell bot. And then that one's a law bot because it's like a boss cog. Oh, does the music change depending on the number? 
I did not know that. <laughs> this is actually a pretty fun group. I like this boss fight. Yeah, just use your throw. That's fine. Just use it. It's okay. Because the thing is, you can use the throw now, and then we're all just gonna sound next round. So every little bit of damage counts. It helps. They seem really persistent on wanting to get rid of the cat. There you go. You see, you're just you're just chipping him down. I like the change in color of the cogs. It's kind of sad outside where I live right now. It's like very like just cloudy and cold. I want it to be like green and sunny again. I want to feel happy again. That's what I need in my life is more happiness. Not more sadness. Another cat flew in. Oh, but it's level 9 though. I know the drill! I know the drill! Oh wait, that one has 195! Oh, what the heck. Maybe we could just go nuts with the sound then. Just go nuts with the sound. Just, just wail him. There you go. Yeah. Remember the cat. That's a good combo. I think one thing that I like about this group is that we actually have communication. We actually have a grasp on what we're doing. We're not just like dozing off and doing our own thing. We actually have something established. Uh, we might need to unite! You know what, I'm just... Uh, we good? Oh, we are gonna see the mentality go up. What's gonna happen to the Mr. Hollywood? Oh, he's doing it too. Dude, you could have like five cogs just doing that like in a row, like lifting their hand up. Like, yeah, raise the roof! Oh crap, no, don't go for the cat. Eek. Yeah, Eek is right. Oh. Oh, I thought somebody died. Okay. There's no cats. So what do we do? I will use a lure. Oh, crap. No, no. Okay. I could lure. I will lure. Let me lure. Bewitched. You've done it again. No! No, okay, no, 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 no. We're in for a world of hurt. Like Coach Zucchini said in that video from like 2009, I think. Oh, crap. Is that going for me? I can't tell. Ah, I'm ready for it. I'm ready for it. My dude. No, no. Take a breath of this. Oh my gosh. Sound Unite, someone Sound Unite, do something please. That one only has two health left. What are we gonna do? Oh, you don't have a Unite? Come on. I'm just gonna use that in hopes of increasing the chances. Use a lure, my dude. Oh my gosh, you're making this intense. Can we still do it? Can we just, like, all just go for the Witch Hunter and just knock him out right now? That would be the best scenario. Come on. Just everybody go for the Witch Hunter. Or drop combo. I mean, just be reasonable. I mean, how much health does he have? 548. It's gonna be tough. Trap drop witch. Mm. 
<laughs> it's gonna be tough. No, no, no. It gets so intense towards the end. No, no, no. They're gonna do a lot of damage. You and your cigar smoking. Don't you be doing that to us. Are we okay? You gonna drop in another cat? No. Okay, we got a basic cog. I think it's possible that we can just take him out. It's like 100, 200, 300. Oh. Sound. Yeah, you want me to sound. Wait, why do you want me to squirt? If this doesn't work, I think we're gonna die. So, I'm like... I'm, I don't, I'm not nervous, I'm just kind of accepting my fate early. If this doesn't hit, then we're pretty much doomed. One, two, three... Plus the extra 100 damage. Oh my gosh, no way. Any unites? Oh, come on. If we survive this, we could just use a low sound or something. Come on. We just have to survive two more, please. We have so many cogs surrounding us now. It's like, uh, you know, cogs, their army is infinite. Like the Empire in Star Wars. Master of Dodging. Okay, 22 health left. Can we just finish it? Can we just... Just finish it? In case if that misses... Yeah, we're just gonna use a couple extra gags in case that misses. So if the sound misses and throw misses, then at least I can drop. We're just using different gags. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I think we actually did it though. I think it's over. The mob's gone. Yep, I think it's over. The game pre-calculated everything. We used the throw. It's over. I've had enough of this Moloch. No matter, you poltroons will learn the error of your ways. We did it though. This was a really well-coordinated group. And we did an awesome job fighting this boss. Now... Oh no, they're not listening to him. Oh... Because he failed. Oh my gosh. We have cog beef. It's interesting not seeing the cogs getting... <laughs> You're not getting blown up, they just leave. They're like, yeah, you beat me, but you're not gonna actually destroy me. Is that it? That's it! We beat the boss! Well, that was pretty good. I still think the Rainmaker was actually a lot better than this one because there were so many different things going on, much more different effects. There was two different endings to it, which I thought was really special. But this boss fight was special as well. I had a lot of fun doing this one. We are the best. We are the best. We did good on this boss fight. But that is pretty much it for the Witch Hunter. And real quick, I'm just going to go and talk to the HQ officer so I could finish up the kudos board. That was fun. Let's see. You've returned. Yes. We have done it. I'll let you guys read all of that. I haven't really paid too much attention to the story, but that is it. That is the kudos board. That is the witch hunter. And now I believe the next one in line is the one at Daffodil Gardens, because I know it goes Toontown Central, Barnacle Boatyard, Ye Old Toontown. Then it's Daffodil Gardens. The finest noobs. That's a good group name. Yeah, so if we teleport here... This is my next mission, and it's probably going to take me a long time before I get to the next one, because, um, 
yeah, like I said before at the beginning of the video, I think we're at the part now where it's just going to take much longer for me to get to the end of these kudos boards, because I have some other things that I have to prioritize outside of this, other than doing the kudos board. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. This has been The Witch Hunter. It was a really good experience. We had a really solid group, and I hope that for those who are going to go fight these boss cogs, that you guys get good groups that have good communication like we do because we kept it solid until the very end. So thank you guys so much for watching. And oh yeah, we got the stickers. Huh. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you.